Welcome back to another video with me, Teacher Alex, here at Alex Worldwide. So today we're diving into a topic that is crucial for your success in interviews and beyond. It's about crafting the perfect self-introduction. But before we start on this lesson, don't forget to check the description below for a free PDF companion to this lesson. It's packed with valuable insights and exercises to reinforce your learning from today's video. So let's tackle one of the most nerve wracking questions in any interview situation. Tell me about yourself. Now, this question isn't just about recounting your life story. It's about showing your professional journey concisely and effectively. Tell me about yourself. Now imagine you're in an interview and the interviewer leans forward and drops that question. Tell me about yourself. What do you say? Do you launch into a monologue talking all about your childhood, your pets, your favourite pop stars, what you did, all of these things? Do you recite your entire resume or CV, go through it line by line? Well, hold your horses, which means slow down. Neither approach will win you any points. Let's focus on what matters, your professional experience. So begin with a brief overview of your career journey so far, emphasising roles that are relevant to the job that you're applying for. For instance, if you're interviewing for a teaching position, start by highlighting your teaching experience. Maybe you've spent the last few years teaching students in a classroom, but before that, you were working in a different type of job. That's okay. Emphasize the relevant experience first. Now, let's talk practical examples. So when you're discussing your experience, consider using phrases like, in my previous role as a teacher at so-and-so school, I was responsible for handling student inquiries. One of my key achievements was helping students achieve good grades, which had a positive impact on their future. I'm particularly proud of my work with volunteering in underprivileged schools, where I made an impact helping underprivileged children. Remember, it's not just about listing your duties, it's about showcasing the impact that you made. Whether it's implementing time-saving systems or exceeding targets, make sure that your achievements really shine through. Now, here's the golden rule. Make it relevant. Make sure your self-introduction to the job is first. Connect your past experiences with the requirements of the role that you're applying for. Show the interviewer why you're the perfect fit. So imagine you're interviewing for an office manager position. Here's how you might structure your response to tell me about yourself. Start with your current role, highlighting your achievements and seamlessly transition to how your skills align with the job that you're applying for. When making your self-introduction on relevance, consider phrases like this. I noticed in the job description that you require someone who is organized. In my previous role, I was very familiar with the organization processes used in the office. I'm excited about the opportunity to be involved in helping volunteers as it aligns perfectly with my experience in the volunteer sector. My background in science has prepared me well for the challenges outlined in this role. Now, I don't know what job this is that I'm applying for, lots of different experience, but it's giving you that phrasing. So now it's your turn. In the comments below, craft your dream job self-introduction using the structure that we've discussed and incorporating these practical phrases. Remember, don't forget to download the PDF for extra practice. Your future interview success starts here. 
So that's all for today's lesson, you global learners from all over the place. I hope you feel more prepared at tackling that daunting tell me about yourself question. And remember, if you're eager to level up your English, then don't hesitate to join my Patreon English Club for daily English exercises and help one-on-one -on -one with me. Can't wait to see you in the next video. See you then.